Man's Search for Meaning is a memoir and psychological treatise written by Viktor E. Frankl, a Holocaust survivor and psychiatrist. The book was first published in 1946 and has since become a classic in the field of existential psychology. The book is divided into two parts. The first part is a memoir of Frankl's experiences in Nazi concentration camps during World War II, including Auschwitz. Frankl describes the brutal conditions he and other prisoners endured, including starvation, disease, and constant fear of death. He also reflects on the ways in which the prisoners attempted to maintain their humanity and dignity in the face of such inhumanity. The second part of the book is a philosophical and psychological exploration of the human search for meaning. Frankl argues that the most fundamental human need is the search for meaning in life. He contends that this search for meaning is what allows us to endure even the most difficult circumstances, such as those he experienced in the concentration camps. He also suggests that meaning can be found in any situation, even the most dire, and that it is possible to find a sense of purpose and fulfillment in life, no matter what the conditions. Frankl also introduces the concept of logotherapy, a type of therapy that he developed, which focuses on helping patients find meaning in their lives. He argues that traditional psychotherapy, which focuses on relieving symptoms, is not enough to truly help people find meaning and happiness. Throughout the book, Frankl draws on his own experiences and those of his patients to illustrate his ideas. He also references a wide range of philosophical and religious texts, including the works of Nietzsche, Dostoevsky, and the Buddha. Man's Search for Meaning is a powerful and moving book that offers both a first-hand account of one of the most atrocities of the 20th century and a thought-provoking exploration of the human condition. It continues to be widely read and studied for its insights into the human spirit and the search for meaning in life.